The Frankenstein we got last year after Halloween, so he's never been used. Eric Peterson grew up in this East Vancouver house with a huge combined family who loved to set up awesome holiday displays that have brought joy to the neighborhood for decades. Uh, well, there's always the big ones, the Halloween and Christmas. Then there will be something for St. Patrick's Day, Valentine's Day. Uh, Pride, we do some flags and some other stuff. Canada Day. Uh, what else is there? Thanksgiving. But the house here on East 12th Avenue and Semlin Drive has recently been sold. So after 40 years of putting on some great holiday displays, Eric's family, who were tenants here at this house, are now moving. First of all, for the last 40 years, we've had an amazing landlord. He's been nothing but great. Uh, for his reasons and valid reasons, they sold the house. It's difficult. Um, difficult because it was it's been 40 years. This final display featuring a huge inflatable Frankenstein that went unused last Halloween says goodbye to the neighborhood. Um, I put up the sign just telling you about us moving in and why we decorate basically and why I want everyone to know why we're leaving. Not that it was sold or nothing to do with just why we're not here anymore because I figured a few people might be a little upset if they saw no decorations with no explanation. The decoration started when Eric's mom, Terry, single at the time, moved in with him and his sister in 1983. 84, she met my stepdad, and he also had two sons. They got married in 85, had my sister in 86, and then they raised five foster children, as well as us, and the decorating has always been part of what we can do when you don't have a lot. People have been sending their farewell cards and honking at the house. So I'm out here a lot in November and people would stop by and say thank you and that's when I realized how much it meant to the neighborhood and the, the excited little kids, it's awesome. Eric says they don't know where they'll go next, but he leaves a hopeful message for all those who pass by the house that decorates for everything. Uh, the last line is stay festive and remember to celebrate everything. Um, and why? It came to mind because when I decorated for Christmas, I didn't know it would be the last time I was decorating for Christmas or any, like, it, I didn't realize that would be it. Um, so it's kind of the idea of celebrate everything in life because you don't know. In Vancouver, Kier Junos, City News.